Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Salam sejahtera dan salam satu Malaysia. Anda bersama saya Fariza Isa di dalam video bimbingan Industri Terbitan Centre for E-Learning and Teaching. Dan bersama saya adalah Ana daripada Zalora Malaysia. Hello Ana. Hi. Assalamualaikum. Hi. Ha, okay. <laughs> she speaks a little of Bahasa because she's from Iran. You're from Iran, right? Yeah. No, I, I Assalamualaikum is international. For yeah. Muslim. Okay. It's Sorry. for Muslim term. Yes. So we are going to speak in both languages today, Bahasa and also English, right? Uh, but it's okay. But I, I can't reply, but it's okay. Okay, we'll have a try, you know. Okay, okay uh, Anna, uh, as we are speaking here, we are in Zalora, Malaysia, right? Mm -hmm. And you are the uh, head of partnerships and PR for yes, Zalora. Right. So tell me about Zalora. Well, I think you can tell a little bit from this frame that we have a very fun environment to work in. Um, it's very fast. Uh, you do a lot of hours, but you enjoy every moment because everyone's very young and it's almost like um, it feels like a family eventually mm -hmm. so you get very close to your colleagues um, and it's one of the reasons that we stay mm -hmm. um, the work pressure is very high mm -hmm. uh, responsibility is very high but one of the key differences between a company like Zalora versus working in the bank is uh, let's say in bank XYZ which is let's say international or even local you're one person in thousands mm -hmm. and your input is hardly recognized mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. sometimes um, you have KPIs or whatever but you're not recognized instantly mm -hmm. you're a number mm -hmm. while in Zalora you might be doing the job of five people mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. single-handedly mm -hmm. but you have a lot of support from your superiors you get a lot of recognition and you get a lot of ownership mm -hmm. and ownership is a key thing so um, when I have a project or when my team has a project we feel 110% responsible for it um, it's not that if there's a mistake and you can say oh but this department didn't help me so everybody has to come together all we expect to see is the end result and it better be perfect. Everyone has to take the responsibility yes. of anything that happens in Zalora. Okay, Zalora is an online retail fashion shopping, right? So mm -hmm. how long have you been in Malaysia? So we started in 2012 mm -hmm. and uh, we've just grown every year. We started with five people mm -hmm. and uh, very small Facebook. I guess the five people mm -hmm. that were working for us were, were the so five that, people the, on Facebook also. <laughs> Does that five people include you? I wasn't in Zalora at the time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I was with uh, our sister company, mm -hmm. but um, I, I've seen the style. So we were neighbors. I was downstairs, mm -hmm. uh, and so, well, we were very mm -hmm. close. And I knew how how it works, I how think. it works, mm -hmm. and how we struggled. Mm -hmm. uh, now we're 200 people mm -hmm. in Zalora, Malaysia. Mm -hmm. uh, across the region, we are 2,000 people. Across the region, that includes all nations in Southeast Asia? Singapore, mm -hmm. Malaysia, Indonesia, Hong Kong, mm -hmm. Vietnam, Thailand, mm -hmm. Philippines. Yeah, I think okay, I covered so, so. <laughs> and, and Brunei, we handled uh -huh. Brunei out of uh -huh. Malaysia. Uh, through Malaysia, right. Yeah. Okay, so um, uh, all through Southeast Asia, which nation, which, which country has the biggest fan of Zalora, the biggest consumers? I would say it's more or less like we've we all started together and we all each market has unique opportunities in it mm -hmm. that allow it to have a competitive advantage over each of us. So in the end it balances out. Mm -hmm. Everyone does pretty well. Malaysia and Singapore are very strong markets mm -hmm. generally because of uh, purchasing power. Mm -hmm. uh, same goes with uh, Hong Kong, mm -hmm. but then you have Indonesia that has population mm -hmm. that will always win. So there's always different factors that uh, kind of have up and down for all of us, but we almost balance out. So all of us now, from the five Facebook fans that we started with, have um, 6.1 million now. That's a lot. Uh, which is a lot mm -hmm. in three years. It's um, All of them are original, so none of them are bought. Mm -hmm. So that, that's the unique thing of Zalora. You only started within three years and now it's a booming business in Malaysia. Okay, um, the challenges, but you're doing international retail, right? Okay, yeah. so mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's not uh, to say that we're doing international mm -hmm. retail alone. Mm -hmm. we're, we have three pillars that we base our business on. Mm -hmm. um, so international brands like Mango, River Island, mm -hmm. New Look, yeah. uh, American Apparel, etc. Mm -hmm. etc. Mm -hmm. Then we have local designers mm -hmm. like Rizal Manjovian, Melinda mm -hmm. Louie, 
fizzy woo, mm -hmm. etc. Mm -hmm. etc. Mm -hmm. Then we have our own private label, Ezra. Zalora, mm -hmm. Ezra, mm -hmm. uh, well, Zalora, mm -hmm. Ezra is now mm -hmm. Zalora. Mm -hmm. Zalora Basics, uh, Zalia, mm -hmm. which is our modest wear, mm -hmm. which is what you're wearing. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank okay. you. And so we kind of grow all three mm -hmm. at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, yes, international retail. Uh, hard to call international. Mm -hmm. It's more international buying of mm -hmm. brands, right? Mm -hmm. um, so all three of them have helped us grow mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. equally. So, so the inspiration of Zalora, I mean, I mean, there are lots of other online shoppings, right? We have Fashion Valley. I, I, I can't name all, but there are too many. You have Pop Look. Right? Yeah. So how do you define yourself different to other, uh, I mean, online retails? Okay, well, um, I can speak for Zalora. Mm -hmm. I, I, the, the industry is huge and mm -hmm. so there's so much room for everyone to play. But I can say that for Zalora, we have very aggressive targets, mm -hmm. as in we have to, to grow at a certain pace mm -hmm. because we believe that, okay, this is just the direction of the company for, mm -hmm. for it to go mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. yeah. You can't stop, okay. right? Mm -hmm. And so. I explained a little bit about the philosophy of yeah. how we work. Sure, sure, sure. I guess one of the reasons that we we do grow so much or we succeed is one, um, we have good fan base mm -hmm. support. Mm -hmm. So we've had good branding, mm -hmm. um, and we've worked hard on getting these two from the beginning. Mm -hmm. We've been quite supportive of our customers mm -hmm. in return. So mm -hmm. you see that when you order from Zalora, there's a voucher inside. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's a thank you. So there's a, we've paid attention to the little things mm -hmm. and we've tried to set our own standards and mm -hmm. not look around to see oh who's doing what and mm -hmm. compare against that but mm -hmm. kind of try to be number one mm -hmm. from by ourselves mm -hmm. like without looking around too much because mm -hmm. that's what, what holds you back. If you look around and say okay but the customer service average answering time in this country is for example like this many seconds. Mm -hmm. We said no customer calls within three seconds, within five mm -hmm. seconds. Let's mm -hmm. let's have our own standards. So, so it's all about setting your own benchmarks and standards. So it's your company's policy. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so my last question. Um, uh, what does Zalora, I mean, your future plans in helping the younger generations in being part of this? You know, it's a generation right now, you buy everything online. You know? Even Tesco has online shopping, I right? think they have online groceries. And so, so how does Zalora help in giving the uh, proper and, and, and wider knowledge to the younger generations? Okay, mm -hmm. so this answer falls uh, into several steps. Mm -hmm. First, mm -hmm. being innovative. Mm -hmm. So how are we innovative? Um, we have pop-up stores mm -hmm. and digital stores mm -hmm. where it's a physical place where you can go and get kind of educated on the online shopping experience. So mm -hmm. the clothes are there, mm -hmm. all sizes, so you go and try it mm -hmm. and then you scan it mm -hmm. and you purchase it online. Mm -hmm. And there's shop assistants to assist you. Okay. So you you have a hybrid of online shopping with, with physical Is shopping. Is it being done already or not uh, yet? Yes, we did it in Penang for three months. Okay. So in Gurnee Plaza we were there. Mm -hmm. Um, so how's the outcome? Was it, was uh, it? it was fantastic. They loved it. All right, all right, cool, interesting. Okay, so any final advices for students who may think to pursue a career in Zalora? Because I, I see always of your advertising say that come and have a career in Zalora. We also have minors from Norway, <laughs> Norway <laughs> pursuing a career in Zalora. Maybe any advices for them? Yeah, it's mm -hmm. a really nice international community to kind of to, to work mm -hmm. with. Mm -hmm. um, well, <laughs> I don't want to sell too hard, yeah. but it is one of the best places probably to work in. Yeah. Um, most of us work here because we enjoy and we learn a lot. Mm -hmm. I think that's the key thing. So if you want to learn a lot and you want to learn that fast, mm -hmm. so if you're in a Russian life, um, <laughs> I would suggest joining a company like Zalora. Or I mean, if, if the opportunities don't arise here, um, any company that you see, I mean, I don't want to hard sells yeah, Alora only. Yeah, Basically, yeah. as a career advice, take an opportunity where you see that you're going to have a pushy boss, <laughs> but a good environment where you can learn a lot. Mm -hmm. And um, sometimes learning through trial and error mm -hmm. is more valuable than learning from like a guy who's had 50 years experience in marketing. <laughs> because if it's a new industry like e-commerce, no one else has done it True. for too long. So where are you going to learn from? True. Um, True. And uh, 
when we started, a lot of things were from trial and error, and I really enjoyed that experience. Mm. I so, the, so Anna is one of the pioneers with Zalu. I don't. <laughs> so in no, case if you students much. out there bump into Anna, you have to ask lots of questions no. and learn a lot from her. All right, so I think that's for now. Thank you, Anna, for being with Thank us. Thank you so much. And we are currently in Zalora. So if you want to know more, nak tahu lagi banyak pasal Zalora, just go to www.zalora.com or download the apps. Or I'm I'm doing the promotion now. Yes. Okay, so you can learn a lot from Zalora. Okay, dah untuk itu sampai di sini sahaja. Saya Faiza Isa. Kita dalam video bimbingan industri cerita sains for e-learning and teaching. Assalamualaikum. Bye.